in Seattle. You're on Free Talk Live. Hey, John. Hey, uh, guys, I hope you'll keep me long enough to explain this thing because I keep hearing stuff on your radio about Washington's marijuana laws, and I'd like to get it straight because Please. I know quite a bit about them. Great. Go for okay, it. Okay, let's start. Let's start with the recreational. Okay, so the recreational you can possess an ounce, and uh, basically it's probably $15 a gram. Not many stores open because the supplies haven't caught up to the demand, okay? So it's legal now, to, at this point of, in Washington State, to open a store. That is now legal? Yeah, that's right. They're open already. The okay. 17 stores open. Got it. But the supplies uh, haven't caught up to the demand, a lot maybe due to powdery mildew. If you've ever grown it, you'll know that there's a thing called powdery mildew, and it does affect quite a bit of growers. Wow. Anybody looking on YouTube can learn a lot about growing. Uh, John, period. hold that thought. We're going to get you back okay. here in a moment to continue giving us more on the uh, from the inside of Washington State about legalization. You start looking on YouTube for that kind of stuff, you should be using ProXPN. Toll-free number, what, for researching uh, marijuana grows. how to grow marijuana? Toll-free number 855-450-FREE. You can take control here on Free Talk Live. John's in Seattle calling with some corrections uh, to some perhaps some misinformation that we had given out uh, or some misunderstandings that we had about the Washington situation. I wasn't sure with legalization. Yeah, you, just don't, you just don't know the full extent of what's going on. Here. Yeah, well, that was one of my okay, big so questions. Let me explain to you what, what's really going on yeah. here. Okay, it's the medical marijuana. Unlike Colorado, they're not mixed together. They're separate. And the legislature already tried to stop what's going on. But let me explain to you how it's going. In Washington State, with a $100 bill, you can get a medical card. Mm -hmm. With that $100 medical card, you can now share that. So, Ian, I'm the sick guy. I'm sharing it with you, okay? Now, we can each grow seven and a half plants, or one grow eight, one grow seven, okay? Now, if I got three cards, because I know three six people, we can now grow 45 plants, mm -hmm. okay? If you know what you're doing and you scrog a plant correctly, you can get a pound off of one plant in yeah. a room that's basically four by four. You have to be a pretty big plant. Hey, take a look on YouTube. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to tell you stuff over and over. Get some education. Okay. Now, the deal is that these people are selling medical marijuana between 5 and $15 a gram. Okay. If you look on Craigslist for Seattle, Tacoma, you will see what I'm talking about is correct. Okay. So these people now who grow just even 15 plants, okay, and you get them the right size, and you know what you're doing. I don't know how much pot you grow, but I know a lot about growing it. So here's the thing. These people legally under the law can sell their marijuana right on Craigslist. Look, it's for sale right there under medical marijuana, and they're clones, okay? Mm -hmm. So you'll pay between 5 and $15 a clone. Mm -hmm. The legislature tried to stop that. But nobody really wants to stop this because this is better than both worlds. So roughly for a $50 license now a year, you now have the legal right to possess 26 ounces apiece, not one ounce as the recreational people. Mm -hmm. Okay, They're taking a the whip to them. The, the medical people, who anybody can get it, can now hold 26, and if he grows for three people, that's three times 26. Have you also observed in Washington what was observed in Colorado earlier this year, and that is that the medical uh, cannabis is selling, even though it's the same pot, selling for less than the recreational? That's correct. The street value right now of one ounce by itself in the medical world, and you may look on Craigslist and see high prices, but you'll see low prices, but the real street value is 140 an ounce for top shelf, OG Sweet. Kush. AK-47 Blue Dream. Mm, that's they half the price right. of what you might pay on that's the black market. Correct. That's why we Washingtonians aren't out there screaming right and left, change the law, because the medicals got them by the short hairs. Mm -hmm. okay? Now, what does a recreational so now, ounce cost? A, a recreational ounce is about one, well, no, because you're going to buy it on it's a store. It's $15 a gram. I don't even know they sell ounces. So really? Look, that it's going to be 300 but... Believe me, the under the underground market is two hundred and falling. Two hundred something. Okay. okay. Yeah. Okay. And, and and a lot of that even goes all the way down to the one fifty. But the pound mm. price is roughly a hundred an ounce. So you buy one pound, sixteen ounces. Damn, $1, that's awesome. And that is that is falling too. And the reason why a lot of this, especially as we come into fall, okay, there's going to be a massive crop coming in. And so all through Thanksgiving and Christmas. Things will be way cheaper. See, yeah, you're right in about Washington, that. 
we don't want to blow like Colorado did and let the state have the whole thing. We've got it made here. Just think of yourself not having much money. And believe me, I know people who are severely disabled who are growing. And now, because you can legally sell under our law, right on Craigslist, you can deliver right to a cop if he's got a medical marijuana card. <laughs> oh, man, that would make a great Kodak moment. <laughs> yeah, and the thing is, that's what I don't think. When people think of it, they say, well, what's Washington doing? They don't realize the underlying thing that's going on in Washington. We are a free state in the sense. I mean, I came here from another place that is anything but free. And now we are free. And, and to think that you, Ian, with no medical marijuana card, if you lived in this state, I could for half of the price of the ticket if you want or half the price of the license, you could now begin to grow and they couldn't do nothing. And well, it's nice that you guys have freedom in this area, but obviously you're not a f there's no such thing as a free state at this point. Um, and in fact, well, I don't it want isn't your kind of freedom, pal. Is it I, I really don't want your kind of freedom. Well, I don't because really know what that even means. Is, anybody who knows anything about business, okay? I like the slaves the way they are. Okay, why the heck would I want to change that? What well, are you talking about? Free, free, they are. And, free and, and once they're in debt to you, they're as good as your slaves anyways, aren't they? Um, I don't know about you, but I'm not interested in having any slaves. So the fact well, that don't you, don't you, you consider people to be slaves – no, I don't. The fact that you consider uh, people to be slaves really kind of belies what you mean when you say you're free there. So I'm really well, confused. Well, I'm free. It's them that ain't free. You know, gotcha. when you, start, you don't own, okay, can you talk about owning that building you're in? I have owned a, own a home in the past, yes. Okay, did you make payments on it? Yeah. So did you send them payments to your master? Um, they weren't my master. They're the people that gave well, me a loan. Well, you interest, didn't he? He didn't do it for free, did he? Right, well, when you ask somebody for a favor in uh, the business world, you have to expect that there's going to be interest involved That's in that it. transaction. That's, That's not master and slave because it's a consensual transaction. I got involved well, in that because— Well, the guy who's collecting the money doesn't really want to lose you. You're the best thing he's got going. You come every month, you give him the money. You give him a little mm -hmm. extra called interest, why would he want to lose you? Right, so okay, I'm not his slave because I agreed to the deal. A slavery is inherently— uh, Non-consensual. Thank you very much for the okay, call, John. Whatever. Enjoy your cannabis. The toll-free number is 855-450-FREE. That's 855-450-3733. I think I agree with him. Uh, John and I definitely do not have the same ideas about freedom. It's Free Talk Live. Free Talk Live, seven nights a week from 7 to 10 Eastern, live on the Liberty Radio Network at lrn.fm. 